What's up, bitches? No, I'm just kidding. Hi, how's it going? Um, I feel like I've been going for a while, but let's just get right into it. So, I wanted to do a, um, a Spotify wrapped video, like my, um, 2022 replay on Spotify. Um, but I switched out on music in October or November. And so, I guess because because of that, like when I go to Spotify, it doesn't give me the option to like see the songs in the playlist. It just lets me like shuffle them. Um, so instead of just like shuffling through all those songs, um, since I can't see them as a list, I guess we'll just go through Apple Music, which I've only been using for um, like a month or two. So this is like not my 2022 rap. This is like my third quarter wrapped but it doesn't really include december so really it's like my last month wrapped i guess but girl we're just gonna do it because this is what i have okay um honestly i think i'll just the first 16 songs is just gonna be renaissance to be honest so uh here we have it uh cuff it break my soul i'm that girl cozy like superstar energy heated church girl move all up in your mind Virgo's groove pure honey thick Classic of the Sofa, Summer Renaissance, America Has a Problem. I feel like America Has a Problem is not my least played song, so I don't understand that, but whatever. Um, and then Breakdown by Mariah Carey, my jam. I listen to it all the time. Um, this is Why by Paramore, another jam. Um, I actually got tickets to see them in um, June, July of next year, so I'm really excited about that. Um, for the night by Chloe and Lotto, because I too ask myself why we can't be closer. Um, I love that song, Break My Soul, the Queen's Mix, <laughs> um, which is a remix of Break My Soul, which is a fun remix. Um, so Tavlo, I'm a big fan. The new album, I don't, it's not my favorite, but Attention Horror, I really like. Um, Santa Claus coming to town I have an explanation But I'm not going to explain it <laughs> I will um, It's it's a long story Pineapple Slice I like Bigger by Beyonce So again I want to So I um, I teach Which so um, I play like, like my, I have like two different class playlists On here so I feel like a lot of these songs are going to be from that class playlist, such as Santa Claus Come to Town and Bigger. Um, to Die For, I feel like I didn't listen to a lot. Running, that's definitely from the class playlist, but it's also my jam. Um, Grapefruit, love that song. Thank You, Next, also on the playlist. I'm to blame. I'm, not, I'm familiar with that one. Original Sin, also on the playlist. Days on the playlist. Um, a holy night. That's not a brightly shining. Um, so obviously it's the Christmas season. So Celine Dion's Christmas album is like my top three. Okay, it's excellent. So a holy night's the first song. Don't save it all for Christmas Day. The second song. Both are honestly probably my favorites on the album too. So um, this next song, NYCBB. Playlist, sweater weather, playlist, but also a classic, okay? This one takes me back. All I am is man. I want the world. What is that? Am I in? I hate the beach, but I stand in California with my toes in the sand. Use the sweets of your sweater. Let's have an adventure. Head in the clouds, but my gravity center. Touch my th Love, true romance, nothing but these. There was sun. Sorry about the dog barking. That wasn't my dog, by the way. That was outside. Oh, I wish I could what used to be. Oh, I wish. Um, there was sun. So that's on the album World Panic, um, the complete edition, um, which is the, that covers for. That is my song. So I love nothing but these. 
three studio albums are like literally flawless. It's very impressive. Um, I guess there's three slash four because complete edition is has additional songs, but let's just say three. Um, but that is my song. That one I think might be on the playlist too, though. Um, Amar Jacinto El Amor, one of my favorite Celine Dion songs, also on the class playlist. Suburbia, um, a good song. It, um, I need to watch that for a while because I, um, you know, she mentioned it in the song, but I've never watched it. Sort of like in, uh, doom, doom. like you know what i've never seen scarface so let me watch it and i'll watch the movie just for the song so maybe i'll do the same for um como se dice um step for wives i'm all over christmas as you i mean obviously it's, it's holiday season let's be serious the magic of christmas day i have a celine christmas song i need a good kick kick in the head tough low heathens um that one's also on the class playlist but i love uh Cute and Cruel, a familiar Land and Sea, that's on the class playlist. That's on the class playlist. I love relaxing French Celine. Um, Spirit, also on the class playlist. My Little Love, I don't know, that's not on the class playlist, that's just my song. So I'm positive if we were to do the Spotify one, which I think, like, it's almost worth it if I just pay for one more month so I can see my Spotify. Because um, I'm, I, I know the whole entire 30 album is going to be on there. But My Little Love is probably the top three favorite songs on the album. I wonder if my favorite one's going to be on the list. Natural Cost, that's on the class playlist. Blue Lights, class playlist. Um, Uncle Soir, class playlist. Aquaman, my song. Also on the class playlist. Telephone number. Oh, that's um, Japanese pop. It's also on the class playlist. I'm working down now. Class playlist. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Out of all the people in the world. Also my song. Ave Maria. Obviously it's Christmas. Level du Nage is probably my... It's like maybe my... I think my top five Celine Dion songs. Also on the class playlist because I love that song. Never Enough from um, The Greatest Showman. You guessed it on the class playlist. Blue Christmas. Oh, I love a blue. I love Celine's version because she is like singing down and it's so low key and I didn't even like realize how excellent it was until I like got um, the new headphones and I was like oh my god there's so much going on and her like runs and Laura just there's all just chef's kiss um, Billy Bossa Nova I'm not sentimental but there's something that the way you look tonight um, that is probably my favorite song on that album that or Lost Cause um, so that's also on the playlist so let me, I should have put a disclaimer. Since I got this streaming service, Apple Music, in like November or October, I think it was October or September. I'm dragging it, probably was like September. Um, you know, I, in my personal time, I listen to mostly Renaissance, okay? Um, and then at work, I just have one of the two class playlists on shuffle. One like has like words and like a little bit more upbeat music and one's more relaxing. So if I'm listening to Renaissance for the most part of my own time and that was the first 16, the rest of it is mostly going to be what I listen to at work. Um, so it's mostly going to be the playlist songs, which is not a good indicator of like my year of music, which is why I want the Spotify one. But on the flip side, the Spotify one, is from the whole year, which means it's also probably going to be mostly songs from um, the class playlist, but at least it'll be 
more like interspersed with songs I listen to in my own time. But I also made the playlist, so these are still songs I like. So, um, Seven Rings. Let me. You see, I can't even get it out because that really is my song. You like my hair? Gee, thanks. Just bought it. I see it. I just discovered I've been playing it a lot. Um, oh, come on, you faithful. Celine. We fall down, but we get up. We fall down. Uh, Tony McClurkin. Another, uh, sorry, McClurkin. Another gospel song. I've never seen the righteous. I've never seen another gospel song. Um, oh, Holy Night. Kind of gospel, but um, I'm pretty sure Holy Night, the first song on Mariah's Christmas album, too, or is it? Um, no, I think she opens with what's the other one? Maybe it is Holy Night because I know Celine opens with Oh Holy Night, and I know Mariah's opens with something like Deep in the Ballad as well, um, Sweet Abandon. Um, so Alex Vargas, I love. Um, discovered him from my friends because he was on um, Above and Beyond. They have like a couple of like acoustic albums, and one of them, Oz Vargas, was on a song um, called Alone Tonight, which I'm obsessed with. And this is from um, his album, I think the album's called Cohere. So I love the song Sweet Abandon. It's also on our class playlist. This Christmas, five sides blazing. The 
some song by something two wings the care that's a gospel song
hopefully it was still relaxing. And uh, yeah, thank you for joining. Until next time.